So we lost both of our Instagram accounts. And I'm gonna to explain to you what's happened over the last three to four weeks to get them back, as well as what we've learned about ourselves and about our companies, right? So on January 20, the Hustle Squad Insta went down. 48 hours later, the system Insta went down. It was unexpected. There was no reason. There was no explanation. Essentially, we just had all of our content wiped. We couldn't log in. We couldn't do anything. We couldn't access anything. Thousands of DMs gone, all our videos gone, all our history gone. Essentially, our company's heart was ripped straight out for, for no reason, right? During that time, we were angry, we were scared, we were uncertain about what the was going on. And basically, we have then used that opportunity to look deeper as a three, Steve, myself, and Tom, to basically further cement some of the processes involved in our business. We've identified holes, which we've now been able to fill and improve. And essentially we've used that shit ass diabolical situation. Obviously there's more important shit happening in the world that is way deeper than this. But as a business and as a company on social media who rely heavily on Instagram, it was a massive hit to the heart and it hit us like a ton of bricks. So instead of sitting there sulking, yes, we did sulk in the background. We lost motivation. We didn't want to make videos because there was nowhere to post them. We sat down and tried to improve this. And the reason I'm telling you this is because if you are in a shit situation, there is always light at the end of the tunnel. And it may not seem like that in the short term, but I promise you, if you stick at what you believe in, if you stick by looking at things with a positive mind instead of a negative one, and if you look out and zoom out at things and look at it from a different perspective, you can use these opportunities to further improve whatever you're doing. For us, it was an improvement in our diversification across our social media platforms. We have planned 2023. We've organized all sorts of different things when it comes to social media content processes and systems, which are gonna make our processes more efficient. And most importantly now, we have a direct contact at Meta, which has now massively helped the security essentially of our Instagram, which is absolutely elite. And that has come about through power of association with some of our contacts on our Instagram, which we, funnily enough, luckily came into contact with. Whether that's luck or not, I'm not sure. But shout out to Carl, you're an absolute legend. And I guess before this gets to the three minute mark, I wanna make sure that if you are in a situation that is shit, make sure you use it as an opportunity to fix up things and grow. Because you'd be very, very surprised what can actually happen when you get into a shit situation. And what can happen a month, two, three months later, after the fact, after all the emotions settle and how much positive shit can come out of a shit situation. So take this as an inspiration to actually use a negative situation to learn, to grow, and to improve whatever it is you're doing.